could you imagine if this happened here? If we go to war with Russia, uh, we could find that our youth uh, may have to be conscripted. That's a bit alarming. Yes, head of the British Army, one of the most cerebral thinkers that we've got, a strategist. We need to listen. And but I don't think it'll work. I'm not saying it couldn't happen. It could happen, but it wouldn't work. Let me explain by using the map of consciousness by Dr. David Hawkins and his team. You see this level here, level 200? This is the level where truth starts. Everything below that level is destructive. It was only as recent as the 1980s that the overall consciousness level of humanity surpassed 200. Before that, like in 1914 with World War I and in 1939 with World War II, humanity's consciousness level was below 200, and therefore it was easier for governments to draft people through propaganda. But now we live in a world where humanity calibrates a little more on the truth side. Not by much, but a little more. About 211 at the point of this video. So no, I don't believe it will work, because we know better now, especially our youth. We know it's important to stand up for ourselves and protect our country, but we are wise enough not to send our sons and daughters to feed a never-ending war machine. Because what all this is, is just about money and greed. And, but we're still on a peacetime defence budget of just 2%. That does need to change. And the Red Sea is a great example that if you don't step forward, if, you don't, uh, if you're not robust in dealing with those that are testing the, 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 uh, the envelope, um, it will be our uh, weakness will be exploited and it will affect our economy.